Hey guys, so um, welcome back to my channel. Um, really glad to be back here talking to you guys. I wasn't able to upload on Sunday because I did um, get a little bit of like a cold or something and I wasn't feeling too good. But now I'm okay and back and running. So I hope you enjoy my video of uh, bath. This was taken last Saturday, so... Um, that would be the week of the would be the week of the third. So that was Saturday of that week. And also the next video that I'm gonna be uploading soon is um, of my trip to Bristol. I'll give you a little like hinter and tips about where you should go and what you should do there. Um, yeah, I yeah, hope you guys really enjoy. So hey guys, I'm taking a walking tour of Bath today and. Um, yeah, so you'll see some clips of Bath. And these are the shops along, like, the heart of Bath. Okay. Okay, so we've arrived at the Roman Baths and we're gonna go in. So, it's a World Heritage site. And right now they're doing some construction on the side, I think, to like do preservation work. But we're gonna go ahead and go inside. Yay! Okay. So as you can see, there's a huge lineup to go in and there's like even more people inside. So today we're not going to go to the Roman baths. We're going to see if we can do anything else and maybe do the walking tour instead. And this is the Bath Abbey. It's also another really famous landmark for the um, town of Bath in the UK. It's right beside the Roman baths and we're going to see if the line's a little slower here or smaller here so we can go in and see what's inside. So we're inside of Bath Abbey. I'm not sure if you can hear me or not, but um, it is absolutely fantastic in here. You can see like the architecture and the stained glass windows. In these pews, they do have those knee, um, kneeling things, so that when you do the prayers, you can kneel on them. So, if you guys can see the stained glass windows, apparently there are 56 scenes from the life of our Lord. I'm not sure how well you can see them. That is pretty amazing. There's a list of people who have led the Abbey since the 7th century until now. And that is all of their names. Before we make our way up, there's just a few things that I would like you to remember. So we have an old bell rope here, so if you feel you need support on the way up, please do take hold of it. Don't worry, it's no longer attached to any bell, so you will not make any noise. Okay, so we're going to take a tour of the Abbey Tower. So dark. about 120 steps of the towers and now we are halfway up the tower. That is connected to the treble bell. That is our lightest bell, also our highest in pitch. Weighs in about 330 kilograms. We're then moving anti-clockwise by made of music box. Someone would have stood here, they have rotated and cranked, this bell would have rotated, and these pins, they would have come into contact with those levers. They would have then spun up. And ropes coming out the back, which next to hammers. Just taking another sixty steps up to the belts.
just so that you don't get caught out. Uh, about half a second warning before the top. when I have to go down. So apparently this is Julius Caesar. And these are other statues of the emperors. The Roman box. So we actually ended up coming in here because the line just dispersed after our tour of the Abbey. And this is the actual bathroom. You hear the flow of the water. This is from the sacred spring and it just flows into the river. Okay, so this is the must-do when you come to bath. You must try the spring waters from this bath. Apparently it can cure you of any disease and any kind of ailment that you have. It's quoted by some people. If they can't be cured by drinking the bath and bathing here, they can't be cured anywhere. So, I'm gonna do this. Ready? Um, yeah, so if you guys enjoyed this video, please drop me a like, a uh, favorite, or a share so that you can, you know, share it with a whole bunch of friends. Maybe someone else is coming to England or something and they want to visit these places. Um, then you'll know what to see and what to do. Also, yeah, um, hop over to my next video because it's coming out really soon about Bristol.